Hey guys, today I'm back out again with another drawing video on how to draw a surgeon. I don't know if you watched that one short or not, because you should have, because, yeah. I'm going to be teaching you how to draw a sturgeon, an even better one this time. So let's get started. So, of course, we're going to start with the nose. Apparently, the nose is kind of like... It goes like a point, like like that, and then yeah, the the nose. It's just like that. And then under the nose, you're gonna put a curve. It's gonna go up and up, all the way up, and there. And then you're gonna add some whiskers like that, or like thick. It's like kind of like a saber tooth tiger. Now you're gonna put like some kind of drawing things and yes you do realize that i kind of outlined the whole thing because this surgeon was kind of hard to draw so i instead i just outlined so so that's why you can see some parts of the surgeon a little bit okay now this is where the draw area is i think yeah then you're gonna go up you can just make it curve if you want like a gill but i prefer it like this and then you're gonna make a line ending that so it's kind of like a jaw yeah then you're gonna put an eye you can put it like an like a regular eye but i prefer this eye like an eye like that he has dilated pupils bro now the next thing you're gonna do is you see this point you're gonna do this then put a curve if you haven't seen my drawing squid video, then you should check it out. It's pretty cool. So until you do that, now you're going to add the gills. So for this, you're just going to put like a whole curve. Now we're going to do the, the, like the spines. It's kind of like a dinosaur fish. Now you're going to put there and then the stuff. And now the things you can little a little bit see the spike already because I outlined that. And then the next spike, we're gonna put a little a little line over there. And then gonna put that down. This, this might be a little tricky for you guys, so just copy that. And now once you've done that, you're gonna put this and this. It kind of looks like he has a cheek, a little giant cheek. So now you keep going. So apparently this one is gonna go here, like that. And then this one is gonna go down and then curve into it. Now you're gonna do the same thing, except it's next, smushed. So you're gonna go like on the top there and then curve into it again this time more on top and straighter this and then go into it again this and into it and this one might a little be different because it looks weird when you just keep doing it so like this there go down a little bit and then there and then this one is not going to connect to anything just do this And then you're gonna connect to everybody by putting some lines. And then for this part, there, there. It should look like this. So now you're gonna you're gonna make the 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 little arm or the fin. So you're gonna go down here. You're gonna make like a upside down U a little bit. And then go like this. Make one side of the U long. And then the other side of the U long. And then you're gonna put end that into a point. Like that. Now for this part, the other part, you're just gonna put some spikes. Like no, it doesn't have actually spikes in real life, but you just wave it around. Then you're gonna draw the lines. 
You don't have to do this step if you don't want to. Everything has all everything has to all lead to this part over there. So now your sturgeon should look like this. Now we're gonna draw the underbelly or the belly. So it's just the simplest it's the simplest thing, just do that and then like that. Oh, I forgot to add this together and then add some spikes. Now for the outer fin over here, there's a other fin. Kinda helps it a little stuff. Like that. And then they're gonna add more structure. So like this. Then over here, we're gonna end the tail, but like it's a tail, so you're gonna put it up like that. This one down. This one is gonna go up there. And then it like that. This one connect down. Sorry, I cut the video because my hand was accidentally touching the record button. So there. And it looks like we're done, but no, we're not done just yet. We need the, the like some spikes over there. So just draw a sideways long U and then add a little triangle on it and then just keep going. And that would make the like some spikes on the thing so there it should look like this it kind of reminds me of the dominus rex i'll show you i'll show you a picture yeah it kind of reminds me of that with the scales so now let's get to shading so i'll be right back and you could just look at the sturgeon for a little bit <laughs> 